AI Explained, Understanding the Basics of Artificial Intelligence In 1956, the term AI was coined as a task performed by a machine or program that, were human to do the same task, would require at least some intelligence to complete. There are two types of AI, narrow and general. Most computers use narrow AI. They're intelligent systems that know how to conduct specific tasks without having been explicitly programmed to do so. Apple's Siri is a perfect example. These systems use pattern recognition, natural language processing, machine learning, and data recognition to make decisions, like for self-driving cars or spam filters. General AI, also referred to as human-level strong and superintelligence AI, can understand and reason within its environment, just like a human. Think how from 2001 A Space Odyssey. It's strong because this AI will be stronger than us humans, and general because we'll be able to apply it to all problems. However, it's nearly impossible to create a computer that can think, innovate, or plan. AI can solve particular issues or address specific problems. The whole brain architecture approach is an engineering-based approach to create a human-like artificial general intelligence by learning from the architecture of the entire brain. The closest thing we've got today to general AI is machine learning. This term describes feeding vast amounts of data into a computer system, which then extrapolates it to carry out a specific task, like Facebook's algorithms that can recognize faces from your contacts list. 62 years after its inception, we're still working to achieve true AI. So it's hard to guess when, but perhaps new innovations are inching closer each day. Interested in implementing AI in your business process? Contact us today at info at for a consultation or learn more on our website.